Sunday night was Derek Harper Jersey Retirement Day. We'll have plenty on that story later in a different package. But let's talk about the Mavericks. They hope to snap a two-game losing skip. They just really were off rhythm all night long facing the Knicks. They could close it out tonight. The final score, 100 to 96. Rick Carlisle says he's still proud of his team. In fact, he told them that in the huddle in the final four minutes. But here's what he had to say as Dallas dropped his third straight game. It's really the same old story. It's, you know, it's an early hole. It's a late rally um, and didn't come up short. And, and bottom line is we got to be better earlier in the games. One story that emerged tonight was the officiating, especially down the stretch. J.J. Barea was bleeding twice. He had a couple elbows. Here's what his coach had to say. I haven't seen replays. Well, uh, Barea's bleeding. You know, he's bleeding after one. He's bleeding more after the second one. And the fact that those are called is, is tough. You know, it's just tough. Wesley Matthews is really in his groove. He's been playing great these last few games. Tonight, he got a little shoving match with Christoph Porzingis. They were physical at the end. He talks about that encounter. I got nothing against him. I got nothing against him. He's a great player. Um, I actually like watching him play. You know, he's tremendously talented. Uh, you know, future of our league. Yeah, it's just competition. I mean, that's all that is. I put the guy at the door, you know. I dap him up after the game. <laughs> No beef there. That's it for us at the American Airlines Center. Again, congratulations to number 12, Derek Harper. I'm Tamara Jolie. This is Dallas Sports Fanatic Post Game Show. Have a great week.